you, that got down here that made you the bastard that you are. And become pure spirit. So the children represent innocence. That's why he said you gotta be good and naughty and nice. It's a metaphysical shit. You see what I'm saying? It's a metaphysical thing. You see, he's writing his lips and he knows everything. That's talking about the other type of collective unconsciousness. Your soul knows every damn thing. You see what I'm saying? He's fat. The goddamn Buddha is fat. Same Buddha, same Christ. Fat in ancient civilization represents humbleness and jolliness. It's a divine attribute in other societies. See what I'm saying? It represents a form of non-ego, divineness. The Buddha was fat. His wife is fat. The Kundalini Represents if you do the yin and the yang symbol, you got the white in there too. Mm -hmm. But okay. you got the white in there too, and you got the white ball in the black child. But the Kundalini or the staff of the hoodie is situated where the top of the rise is where the North Pole. Now go get the movie Santa Claus. The movie Santa Claus, um, yeah, the comedy, the little thing, the Santa Claus, remember? The suit, the, the, the guy fell off the roof and died, or whatever, disappeared, and the suit jumped on him. He goes to the North Pole and says, who's in charge here? They say, you in charge. Remember that shit I was telling you about the point of life, baby, and I was talking about, you got to be in charge? He said, no, 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 wait a minute, hold on, hold on. Who's in charge? They say, read the label. He who wears the suit. Melanin, Kundalini energy, black guy, is in charge. <laughs> you in charge! You all through the Bible they talk about putting on the garments of Christ. Putting on these suits and these garments. The armor, that ain't nothing but your fucking aura. They say garments of white. That's your aura. So you'll know the right man, he shines. That's in Revelation. You see, they say, you the, you, you the boss. Who was he talking to? L. Who are L? That's the Suave and the Pygmy. He the king of the Pygmy. He's Osiris. A Patah. And Patah has 72 children. Or 72 deities. That's the Goetic spirit. You see what I'm saying? The great spirit. The North Pole also represents another dimension and another land. That's the that's heaven. That's the cloud. Which is not talking about the cloud is talking the cloud represents light. Ice. That's called the cold wave. 